So Yen Sid, of course, he's the homie from, uh... Oh yeah, we better not, now with the mighty fucking Pete. Uh, he's the homie from Fantasia. Yeah, Fantasia, which is, like, 50 years older than me. Yo, what are you two talking about? Oh, what the fuck? As soon as I walk up, you... Come on. Yeah, we, <laughs> yeah, we did defeat Maleficent over a year ago. God. Uh... Hold on, let me check this, some shit real... Oh, God, we got a lot of new items, huh? Oh, the money pouch and crystal orb. Uh-huh. Six mithril shards. That'll be cool once we see a Moogle. Uh, I do want to check abilities. And we've got item boost. I doubt I'm really going to be using that very often, but... I mean, whatever. The weekend often. Sure, sure. Yeah, Goofy. <laughs> so glad you got item boost. Because I'm not giving you items ever. Well, maybe if it's like... A really tough fight? I guess. Like, if we do, like, the Colosseum. Although, I never really like giving potions to them as much as ethers, probably. Actually, I, I don't know. Now I'm just flip-flopping. Oh, this place is so cool. Come on. Oh, boy. <laughs> so these are these ridiculously tough heartless he sent in here to fuck Yen Sid up. How is he? We're getting one money per Heartless? That sucks ass. <laughs> Defeat all of the shadows. I'll try my best. <laughs> Maybe I'll do it. Oh, Sora feels so weak right now with no techniques. No dodge roll, glide, any abilities like that. He just feels su like such a scrub. I'm ready to do all the flips and reaction commands and gliding and high jumping. Collect all the money before it disappears. Oh, I need some draws so I can collect them from further away. Yeah, Goofy, fuck you. That's my shine. I wonder if that door is going to go up or down. That was weird. That was just kind of a... a like a fight that had not a lot of purpose behind it. Sub Shadow! Ugh, Shadow the Hedgehog would fuck these shadows up. Magic and AP. Oh, more AP. Nice. Magic is not really something I'm going to go crazy about. Because all the magic spells I'm going to use are defensive. That's how these Kingdom Hearts games go. Like, attacking with magic, for mo the most part, is just, like, not as good as just attacking. It's good to be defensive with magic. Like, the way um, you can only control one party member, it's not good to rely on them healing you. Oh, we got a shadow! And it looks like he's got that final mix recolor. I would like... I'm pretty sure we could do a... Reaction command. Oh, there it is! Boy! Oh, yes! Love those reaction commands! That's how Kingdom Hearts... It starts getting so stylish later on. When you fight all these enemies and you can do all these reaction commands and shit. Oh, I like this. You guys can actually take some hits. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Boy. Oh, get back here, bitch. Oh. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh. Oh, come on. I guarded that. That's my guard. Well, it's a good thing we're on the job then. So, the worlds aren't at peace after all? Now, nah, certainly doesn't appear so. And we know Pete is not from this world. Because I, I guess technically 
we are still in Twilight Town, even though this place kind of, like, is not in Twilight Town. Uh, we don't have any abilities, right? So even though I'm gaining tons of AP, nothing I could do with it as of yet. Any heart? Yes? Shadow- or let's take out the soldiers first. Because even though they are not tough, they can actually do damage. Oh, I saw that. Oh, boy! Ooh, Dark Shard. Nice. Yes. Ha getting lucky with enemy drops will be huge. Because that will- severely cut down on the time it's gonna be needed to grind up the Ultima weapon later on. <laughs> Look at them, they're so like... This is like uh, King Kai and Goku right here. Master Red Sword, it's an honor. Hey there. Show us, show some respect. So, you are Sora. Now then, have you seen the king yet? Yes, we did, Master. But we didn't get a chance to talk to him. Yes, the king has been quite busy of late. Therefore, it would seem that the task of instructing you three falls upon... Okay, so what is the show. king busy doing? Can you tell us that at least? You have a perilous journey ahead of you. You must be well prepared. You mean, we have to go on another quest? I was looking forward to finding my friend Riku, so we could go back to the islands. And yes, do what? I know. Your Keyblade However, is kind of needed to, like, save everyone, Sora. Sora. is connected. Whether you will find your way home to the islands, whether you will return alone or with your friend, and whether or not the islands will still be there. And the key that connects them all is you, Sora. I'm... the key? Chosen wielder of the Keyblade. You are the key that will open the door to light. <laughs> this book contains valuable knowledge you will need for your journey. Study it carefully. Once you have finished, we will speak of the enemies you will surely confront. Oh, the enemies. The scary enemies? Sorcerer's Loft. Yo, these books are fucking huge. Also, hey, what's up, treasure chest? Big treasure chests like this are usually maps. Powerful spells. Yo, are you gonna you're gonna teach us some of those powerful spells? What's up, bro? I feel like you probably have got some uh you know some tough shit here that you could do. Um well, we'll read the beginning. Okay, yep, the beginning, yes, we know. Uh you're gonna fight shit. The worlds open their hearts. Okay, I, I, this is basically just describing go to each world, fight bad guys, become friends with people, you'll get stronger. Gotcha, thank you. All answers are within. Well, that's not technic. All answers are within other people's brains. All the answers are within the powerful organization. But not Sora doesn't know that shit. Interlude.
that world between... So this is kind of, I think, like, talking about the plot of Kingdom Hearts 2, but they're not actually giving you, like, the big-time details. Oh, chosen by the young boy leads to his memories! It's like, this makes no sense. Gaze at your steps, all confusion will end by looking at our steps. Thanks, Yen Sid. Remember when he said this has valuable knowledge that'll be important for our journey? He was bullshitting us. That was all BS. Very mysterious. You know, I kind of like the notes in Resident Evil better when it's kind of like, Ah, oh, everything is fucked! I'm fucked! There's zombies everywhere! The world is fucked! More than, oh... Entrust your body to the soothing waves of your memories. Huh. Everything will begin. So I'm just gonna take from that, Hey, the final boss will be tough. Make sure your asshole's prepared. Goof, what's up, boy? Yo, if he just keeps doing this throughout the entire game, I'm gonna love that. I might actually have to write these adventuring rules down. Let, let's definitely keep our eyes on if Goofy's gonna keep doing that. We need to know what's going on. Good thing this book didn't tell us jack fucking shit. Important, are you fucking... Yeah, actually, it made no sense, bruh. Please, enlighten us. But wait a sec. How come the Heartless are still running around? Your past endeavors did prevent an immense effusion of Heartless from the Great Darkness. Make no mistake about that. However, the Heartless are darkness made real, and darkness yet lingers in every heart. The Heartless are fewer, but while darkness exists in a single heart, it will be difficult to eliminate them. Gorge, that must mean if everybody's heart was full of light, them heartless would go away. <laughs> That's impossible, goof. Now, it is time to speak of the enemies that you will encounter. Oh, yes, okay, yeah, let's talk about this. That's Donald. Donald, you're the enemy! If one such as you, Donald, yields to the darkness in their heart, they too will become a heartless. But you know this. The heartless are always lurking and ever seeking to capture new hearts. Never let your guard down. Now then. At times, if someone with a strong heart and will, be they evil or good, becomes a heartless, the empty shell they leave behind begins to act with a will of its own. Alright, so that's important. So only really strong people can leave An behind nobody. whose heart has been stolen away. A spirit that goes on... Like we know that when Sora from lost his heart, his oh, nobody see, was Roxas, nobody who Roxas is really do not powerful. Truly exist at all. Nobodies may seem to have feelings, but this is a ruse. They only I, pretend I to have hearts. I almost don't agree with the you way they say that. Be Basically, Jens had just said nobody. nobodies... They don't, don't have exist. emotions, they're just pretending, but that does seem like bullshit. B.S. Now then, the being you see before you is known as a Dusk. They are the most common form of nobody. But there are others, some larger, some with frightening and unique powers. Be vigilant. On your journey, you will meet an alarming number of Dusks. They will all attempt to do you harm. Still, they are nothing but empty shells destined to return to darkness. But... <laughs> Goofy! The beings you see before you now are different. 
These powerful nobodies have formed a group called Organization 13. It commands the lesser nobodies. Organization 13? While heartless act on instinct, nobodies function in a higher manner. They can think and plan, and it seems they are working towards a goal. What that goal is, we do not know. All right, so here we have the plot of Kingdom Hearts 2. Stop Organization 13 from whatever the fuck they're trying to do. Forth to fight it. He found the Dark Realm's Keyblade and with it closed the door. Now that was the end of Kingdom Hearts 1. World to world, fighting the heartless as he Oh, okay, so the he's just to the riddle Okay, okay, so they do tell us what Mickey's doing. He's doing the same thing we are. Fighting Heartless and trying to figure out and what Organization 13 is doing. First. What, what could he be? Bro, we just saw we'll him! Till we look. Yeah, and the king must know where Riku is, because the two of them were together in the realm of darkness when we closed the door. Now you know, that is a good answer. idea, Sora. Way to use so, your Sherlock Holmes type you brain. Go, you will need more suitable traveling clothes. Oh my god, yes. This Those preschool gap shit is not working anymore. <laughs> Through there, you'll find three good fairies. If you ask, they'll create for you appropriate garments. Gore, Sora. You sure are growing fast. Uh, I guess. <laughs> Time to get even stronger. Yeah, we already examined that. All the mischief the king did years ago? Ah! When Mickey used to be a little tyke. Oh, damn. Are you serious? Yo, let me talk to him. Okay, change your wardrobe. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Me, you guys, Riku, and the King. I don't care who this organization is or what it's planning. With the five of us, I mean, six of us, there's nothing to worry about, right? Yeah, I'm gonna agree with that. Like, we're, like, really strong. Hey, hey, chest! Mithril stone! Oh, that's what's up, bro! What do we got here? Ooh, okay, 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 Sora? Utilizing your magic, okay. Obtaining old powers, oh. What does this say? Possessing all abilities. Oh, okay, so... Keyblade unleashing its ultimate power. Okay, so... All of these are... Overcome by the power of darkness. Okay, so we're about to get this thing called dry form, which is new to Kingdom Hearts 2 Interesting that these cloths They all are talking about a different dry form you can get the valor form wisdom uh, This is limit form this you could use all the abilities from Kingdom Hearts 1 This one it's hard to tell all abilities That's probably the master form and then ultimate power is probably final form. And then this is the anti-form. Yeah, well that'll we'll we'll see that eventually. Sup, boo. Oh, okay, so our clothes are gonna give us power. I like that. I like that. Prepared for our journey by doing what? Make us stronger. Yes. Well, look who's here, dears. Sora, Donald, and Goofy. Oh, if you're looking for clothes, you've come to the right place. I'll do the designing. No, oh, that will never do. Blue, oh, oh no, let me guess, red? 
What a shot. Don't you like this better? Hold on. Are you certain? Blue. Enough, you bitches. Just give us our clothes and let's go fight some Heartless. Uh oh, is that Maleficent? Oh, well. <laughs> All right then. Together now, dears. And no more squabbling. The power of teamwork. Oh my. Yes, sir. Oh, it's lovely. Look at Sora, the oh, motherfucking yes. G. Yeah! Now those aren't ordinary garments. They have very special powers. Take the orb, dear. And watch what happens. Wow! Oh yeah! Whoa. Double keyblade, bitch! This journey's going to be twice as difficult as your last. <sighs> oh. Your garments also have other powers. But you'll have to discover what they are as you continue on your journey. Okay, I'll do my best. And thanks a lot. Thanks, ladies, for the awesome powers. And there's something else for you from Master Yen Sid. Oh, boy. Hey! Hey! Yeah, we got new Keyblade and Valor form! Okay, now the forms, depending on which form it is, uh, your teammates will kind of, you know, combine with you to create it. Like the Valor form, um, Goofy has to be in your party and he'll leave the party while we're in the Valor form. So now we can do it at any time! Hey! Okay, real quick. Oh, Goofy, why are you jumping? <laughs> yeah, so basically, it's explaining about the forms and how they have, like, all of their own unique, awesome abilities. And you get your second Keyblade. Woo-hoo-hoo-hoo-hoo, yes, sir. Yep, yep. We Hey, thanks. We got it. Okay, okay, bruh. We got it. We got it. We're good. We're good. Um, Now, if we go over to Sora, I'm pretty sure we can't... Yeah, yeah. So even though we have the Star Seeker, we can't actually even use this as our main Keyblade for now. It's locked into the Valor form unless we get another type of Keyblade. Um, I'll probably be sh be using a bunch of different Keyblades, like until we get to you know portions of the game that actually have any difficulty. I'm probably just gonna be switching Keyblades an awful lot. I don't know for no other reason than just. I mean, fuck it. Why not, right? All right, so Sora, yeah, we're looking all good there. Now, here's Valor's abilities. All types of crazy shit. Basically, yeah, just finishing combos. Very good. With Square. Okay. And, oh, just Square is really good. Gotcha. Now, here's the thing. So, we can level up our drive forms, and when we do that, we will get um, growth abilities like high jump, you know, uh, glide, dash, dodge roll, all that shit. And leveling up your forms is how you can get that uh, for Sora. Because right now, we can use high jump when we're in Valor form. But if we level Valor form up, we'll be able to use high jump, you know, when we're just normal Sora outside of his uh, transformations. Uh, that's just Keyblade and Chan. Scan. Ooh, scan. Yo! Do we? Yeah, we do. Yeah, oh, I'm crazy. We do have scan. Uh, combo plus. Ooh, air cut. Ooh, ooh, okay, 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 okay. Okay, we are ready. Status. What's, oh, yeah, yeah, Valor form status. Next level. And each uh, form levels up differently, too. That's the thing. Um, We are eventually going to be leveling up the Valor form. Do these bitches have anything else to say? No, just that we're fucking strong and we're beasts. We're too nice. We're too real. We're too real for this. We 
We dropped something, eh? Huh? That's that's Sora all the time. Huh? All right, now this is another final mix exclusive thing. Um, each world will have like these puzzle pieces that we can gather. Um, we'll most of them in the worlds we're not even gonna be able to collect until we have some high level growth abilities like you know the better high jump glide shit like that. So, when we see them through our first run of all the worlds, we'll grab them. But I'll probably go back and we'll do, like, a full episode where we collect them all and fuck around with them uh, near the end of the LP. Hey, Jiminy, what's up? What's up, kid? Yup. Yes, certain ability. Yeah, I'm aware. Oh, fuck. Is this going to reset your dialogue? No, it doesn't look like it. They're just saying, hey, blah, 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 blah. Be the opposite of Justin Bieber on your journey. Gotcha. Thanks. Gives us a gummy ship. Yo, I'm gonna. Your name is not Yen Sid. We're gonna call him Swag Sid from now on. So, you guys ready to go? Yeah, let's go on our journey of murder and now, death. Just a moment. Because of your previous endeavors, the worlds have returned to their original states. That means the pathways between them have disappeared. How do we get around? Do not fear. If what the king suspected proves true, the worlds have prepared new pathways along which you may travel. Oh, okay. These pathways may be utilized by unlocking special gates. How these gates are opened, I'm afraid I do not know. However, the Keyblade will serve as your guide. When a beam of light radiates from the Keyblade, return to the gummy ship. Though the worlds may seem far apart and out of reach, they nonetheless remain connected by invisible ties. As do our hearts. Our hearts are connected. That is correct. Got it. But be warned. As you proceed, the heartless and the nobodies will be using their own paths. Corridors of darkness to travel from world Ah, to world. yes. They may be attempting to link these dark pathways to the gates between the worlds. Those are those little dark portals yeah, that all the organization fun. members use. Uh, Riku is also able to use it. Now then, that is all the information. That's because I can of like Ansem's you. presence in his heart Go or whatever, forth, though. Sora, Donald, and Goofy. Oh, Diz can Everyone use them as well. is waiting. Okay, let's get going. Hi. Thanks for the help, Swag Sid. Bye. So I wonder where he fucks off to. My goodness, what's that? Oh, that looks like Maleficent's cape. Haven't we seen this somewhere before? Yes, dear. I wonder whose it was. Oh, Malefa! No, we mustn't remember her name. This is like Nightmare on Elm Street. No, we must not she speak was a her mean name. Old witch. Oh no. The yeah, she was a mean old bitch. Back. I agree. What do we do? Good 
Yeah, that kind of seems like a good. Oh, good job. Yeah, let me stay behind and act like a fucking idiot. Maleficent. Great. So Maleficent is back for no reason at all. There's no reason given for her return. <laughs> Just hey, guess what? She's back. <laughs> Nobody cares, Maleficent. Bye. Fuck off now. You're very weak. Your dragon form sucks dick. You suck dick. It's like, that's ridiculous to think about. So, Yen Sid, Swag Sid, is supposed to like the ultimate G. And Maleficent, she just comes back in the room next to him. Like, what the fuck? Really, Swag Sid? Yeah, Chip and Dale. Alright, you strippers. Okay, the worst part of the Kingdom Heart games. Let's go. Only one? That's no good. Wait, I think it's a world we know. Is it? Yup. Okay. Four hours and 39, and finally we are out this bitch. So it is Hollow Bastion! And then we could see a whole bunch of the other worlds are all over the place. Um, well, actually, yeah, we can only really see just these two over here. Um, so next time, we're going to get to go to Hollow Bastion. Earlier in the game, or t in Kingdom Hearts 1, this is like the last place we go to. So, of course, in Kingdom Hearts 2, it's got to be the first place we go to.